Hi everyone, Connor McDonald here. These are my tips on how to get the best out of the database documentation. Now you've probably just seen that 18C database has been released, so whenever a new database version is released, the first thing I do is jump into the documentation because there's the new features guide, but also the documentation format changes from release to release. So it's good to be abreast of what's going on. Now number one for me is, well, I live in Perth. Perth's a beautiful place, fantastic weather, great lifestyle. I love living here, but it's a long, long, long way away from anywhere. So accessing the documentation online, the latency is a killer for me. So number one for me, when a new database release comes out or new documentation comes out, I take a download of the entire set. Now you can check the YouTube description for the link to download the 18C documentation. You unzip it on your local machine. Now you've got it. 24 seven, even if you're offline. It's always available to you, and it's such a com comprehensive set of documentation, you'll need a long time to get through it. So having it available all the time is a real bonus for me. Second thing I do is sometimes I like to make some small changes to actually help the documentation work best for me. The most important book for me, or the most important link for me, is the bookshelf. That's all the documentation books. Now, if you're new to Oracle Database, you might wanna start with the getting started areas or something like that, or the two day sections. But for me, I like having the entire set of books at my disposal. You can see here in the ACNC documentation, there's a small description for every single book. That makes the list quite long for me. So I've taken a backup copy of books.html. I've edited it now just to add a bit of a style sheet to hide that description away. And now you can see my book list is much more compact. The next thing I'm gonna do is given that it's just a list of books and there's a lot of them, I have a few what I call my go-to books, the ones I'm gonna be accessing all the time. SQL link, peel SQL link, hide package, the admin guide. By taking a copy of books.html, I'll grab those particular books and put them at the top. Now they're easy to get to, I can always access them really simply, and I can still get access to all the books if I need to. So there's my quick tips for getting the most out of the documentation. If you're online, obviously take advantage of the search facilities, but if you're offline or stuck in somewhere like Perth, take a download, manipulate it as you see fit, and there you go, a fantastic use for the Oracle documentation. Happy reading.